Hey guys, uh, this is Defects, uh, and in this video I will show you how you can uh, make a very nice and wide uh, stereo effect uh, in Reason using uh, two subtractors. And I'm starting with a with a, an empty document, just a mixer and a default mastering unit. And I'm I will use two subtractors because I will use one for the left channel and one for the right channel. Okay, so for that. I I will have uh, to put the same preset inside of the of those subtractors uh, in order to have the same uh, the same sound on the left and right uh, channels. Okay, so I will start uh, first uh, creating uh, a reverb, but not this one, because I want to have some effects, uh, not just that dry uh, sound and a delay and these are here on the send channel so when I will put the combinator here I will send those uh, those these two send channels uh, to these effects okay so I will create now the combinator and it's empty as you can see and because I'm using two subtractors I will have to put here a, a mixer inside of it and for the subtractors, uh, when you create the subtractors, you have to press and hold down the shift key uh, because that way uh, reason will not will not link this to 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 the mixer. Okay, so because we don't want that, we have to do it manually. And I will initialize the patch and create another subtractor with the same uh, on the same way, holding down the shift key and I will initialize this one too as I said you have to have the same exact uh, preset on both of them uh, and now uh, you can see that this uh, for example if I create a ma uh, maelstrom uh, it has two outputs the left and right because it's stereo uh, on the subtractor uh, you don't have that you, you only have a one output because it's mono so that's why we use two subtractors and we will use one for the left and one for the right channel and next I will create uh, let me put it here so you can see it uh, well you don't see it anyway it's not on the screen but uh, right click on the subtractor and uh, create a spider audio merger and splitter uh, put it down here Okay, it looks like this, and we will link the subtractors to it, one on the left channel and the other output on the right, and we'll have to link this to parts of the of the splitter. Okay, and the output uh, you can uh, link any of these ones. This is the left and this is the right. You can have up to four outputs. So I'm using the last one. You can use any of them and link them to the to the mixer here, to the line mixer that I created. So you can see everything in, it's inside of this uh, combinator and this is these are the effects. And the combinator is going to channel 1 in the main mixer and these two effects are uh, for the send channels, okay? And well, that's uh, pretty much all that I have to do here uh, as I said you have to put the same preset here on, on both of them and you, if you make uh, any changes for example if I if I reduce the filter frequency to 44 I will have to reduce it here uh, you will hear the effect uh, right now uh, you should watch the uh, this video on, on high quality or I don't know click that link on the video description because you won't hear the on stereo otherwise so I'll play this, I'm gonna put the notes here I have some notes from another document and delete this MIDI channel because I don't need it make sure it's on loop and I'll play this, hopefully I made it all right and it should play and let me reduce the volume, it's reduced, okay so uh, now it sounds I don't know it's, if it's a bug or something you have to touch uh, one of this of the settings of one of the of the two subtractors 
in order to hear that uh, effect and put that back this is to 10 I have to put this back to, to 10 or so and play again so I don't know if you I hope you can hear it. it's a very wide uh, stereo very nice and now I'm gonna send uh, the signal to, to these two effects this is the reverb more damp and a lot more wet and also a delay well it's not the best uh, delay but I don't have time to adjust that okay gonna create a single single uh, subtractor to show you the difference between between a single subtractor and that uh, what I made okay there so I'm gonna initialize the patch and I will use the same notes here uh, let me zoom in to put it right here okay and expand the loop and you will hear the uh, the difference right away, okay? Send this to the effects here. 77 for the reverb. And for the delay it's 97. So they have the same amount of uh of effect on them, reverb and delay, so you should see you should hear the difference very easily. This is the subtractor with a stereo effect. And now comes the single, the single subtractor. Okay, I forgot to reduce the filter frequency. So watch the difference now. That's it. Uh, this is the uh, the effect. It's uh, very easy to do. Remember to use this uh, spider audio and send the two subtractors, one on the left and one on the right, and that output goes to the mixer. And that's it. Uh, as I said, you have to change a little bit one of the settings uh, after you've done that. I think it's a bug or something because uh, it's not sounding so after you you made all the wiring uh, touch one of these uh, settings here so you can hear the effect okay well uh, this is this is the uh, the stereo effect uh, that you can make it's very easy and i hope the tutorial uh, helped you and well see you next time